What's good? It's your boy Fly Guy GBG back at you again with another video. And today we got something important to talk about. I do not care what you think. If you don't think graphics are important, you tripping. Not a nail one of y'all boys is about to play NBA Live 20 or NBA 2K20 if it looks like NBA Live 14, no matter how good the gameplay is. Y'all would be lying to me if you said you would be okay with Russell Westbrook looking like that Ninja Turtle that he was looking like. Even though in real life he kind of looks like a Ninja Turtle, I understand that. But if he actually looked like the NBA Live 14 version. Now before I get too far into this video, tell a hater what? Worry about yourself. No visuals aren't the most important thing when it comes to developing a game, but it is the eye candy. And since it is the eye candy, you want your game to be visually pleasing to your audience. Let's not act like earlier this year when NBA Live started to release those screenshots for NBA Live 19 that we didn't all get excited because of how good the graphics look. Now, based on a lot of people's opinion, it looks like NBA Live 20 will not be at EA Play, but I can't say for sure. But if it's not, it seems like EA Sports is going more of an NBA 2K route where they're going to start releasing screenshots prior to releasing gameplay. Now personally, I'm not upset with this method only because I feel like EA Sports has released gameplay a little too early in the past, which could have maybe possibly hurt them. Now if EA Sports is confident enough to actually release screenshots prior to releasing gameplay, which they haven't done since like NBA Live 10, I don't even know when the last time they did that was. These screenshots definitely have to blow us out of the water, I am saying. One thing I say about EA Sports graphics as of right now is the fact that they look like they go for darker tones, a little bit more of a realistic approach, but it's not really connecting with this audience. So what I'm saying is I feel like they need to go for a more vibrant approach, something that pops a little bit more for those viewers that like that kind of thing. And I got a feeling graphics wise, EA Sports is definitely about to blow us out of the water. If you think about it, each and every year they've gotten better graphically. Even this year, still some of the best graphics for EA Sports. Let's check it out. color correcting the game just a little bit bringing out the vibrancy of the game imagine what ea sports can do with the tools that they have i just did this at home on a computer i'm i'm just saying as i've stated i really feel like ea sports is about to come with it when it comes to those graphics these screenshots about to be crazy and hopefully they don't just put it on the dark court this year so we make it look like it doesn't really look but I need y'all to tell me, one, is EA Sports going to bring NBA Live to EA Play? And two, will these graphics be fire, my guy? Let me know in the comments below. Bars. What's good? It's your boy Fly Guy GBG back at you again with another video. And as y'all can see, we don't get too many of these. This is another live strike. And y'all know what that means when we get a live strike. We got new clothes. We got new gear. We got all that, yeah, hey. 